This guy dropped off at that bus stop. I just want to start documenting the type of bullshit I'm having to go through and torture that I'm going through. The torture is going to work for this, but not by Max. Look at that sign. I have to go to the hypermarket and um, I had to take a bus here from the airport. My mom was arist aristocracy. Her contract to come to the US, her marital contract was to preserve and restore and maximize the aristocracy. It was used to humiliate and degrade her whole life. And I was subjected to the same as her son who identified with her. And uh, I have been subjected to systematic promissory fraud that FBI has refused to investigate under cons uh, Title 18 conspiracy to deprive rights, even though it was motivated primarily for uh, by my um, refusal to conform with the norms of neo-confucian sadomasochistic psychotic order amongst my father's pakistani tribe and also genocide against my mother's um, identity also under title 18 u.s code uh, you know t genocide against my mother's british aristocratic type of identity in uh, you know pakistani aristocratic order and then also um, under human rights law which is uh, supreme law that the FBI is responsible for investigating under and US courts are responsible for applying to situations but which is which is not consistently done and then also this contract law that um, there was an alternative order which is unavoidable when uh, groups of immigrants especially closely closely related immigrants from a collectivist cultures come into the US then they recommune, retry, regather on this side of the citizens test and they establish the same norms that they have going on back home and that results in an alternative intergenerational order which is tyrannical and which is the basis of the misery of the places they're immigrating from and um, that's re-established and the court there's de facto unequal protection under the law for immigrants uh, children of immigrants in that situation because the courts de facto do not uh, understand that those alternative subversive orders subversive to the order order of liberty in the american republic as in fact contracts that to some degree are necessary will persist will exist as extensions of the order back home when when immigrants come in especially in mass closely related and, or from the same places that that will happen but that that must be subject to contract and people's right to disassociate and so anyways i was punished for disassociation or attempting to disassociate after long periods of non-conformity um, i was punished and the power to punish was gained through fiduciary influence it was gained through uh, elicitation of reliance and divorce agreements that were agreed to and negotiated were never fulfilled so the agreements were made in order to get the autistic person me to rely on them and therefore become obsessed with the integrity with context and and then use that to control and punish me further uh, wasting time life potential youth opportunity in the process and then finally defrauding me of inheritance from my mother while in a fiduciary role uh, letting enough t using another such divorce agreement to let enough time pass to where I couldn't uh, it would become very diff it became very difficult for me to lawfully retaliate and then finally when I went to the broader Pakistani community to disassociate um, uh, to, to facilitate some, some type of thing and uh, they sided completely and totally with my father with the new Confucius order because they weren't applying the justice of Islam but new Confucius Eastern Pakistani norms and so that's put me in this situation where look I'm walking around in the desert basically I started a process at the Divan I submitted multiple documents but once they found out how vulnerable I was in my position they, they kind of slowed down the process not really doing much I met with officials twice and I submitted two rounds of documents which were very comprehensive laying out the situation in full and then lastly um, uh, lastly yeah, I'm mean, basically at the airport in Muscat Oman um, trying to figure out what to do because this is my this was my last maneuver. Um, I thought I would go to Al Fajr after this, but it's flooded there and the people there and their own problems, so I don't want to go there. Um, the only the three countries I was targeting were Oman primarily and then Iran and um, and and, and, and uh, Qatar, Qatar. But um, you know I, I'm on the level of means and purpose and pragmatism completely lesser at this point and in terms of faith in god that is increasing but 